It's been just four days since Avigdor Lieberman resigned from his post as defense minister and pulled his party out of the ruling coalition, and Prime Minister Netanyahu is still scrambling to keep the government in one piece. But a perfect storm has begun to brew, leading most to start bracing for early elections. First, the next national elections are mandated anyway for November 2019, but now that Lieberman and his Israel Beitenu party left the coalition with a slim 61-seat majority, cabinet ministers Kahlon and Bennett have started to rally for early elections. And many right-wing Israelis agree that with no clear majority or direction in the Knesset, an election may indeed be the best move. Second, between a controversial budget cut, clashes over military enlistment, and a host of other bills in the Knesset floor, the unity of the remaining parties in the coalition is legitimately in question. Still, Netanyahu has for now taken up the defense ministry position for himself and will attempt to at least keep the government from collapse until his term comes to an end. And Likud officials agree with him, saying that, quote, we have a nationalist government that could continue for another year, and that the smaller parties in the coalition are behaving irresponsibly by creating unnecessary instability.